us are a soldier. We, we are a different kind of soldier. Soldier for Korean people. Mm -hmm. A soldier for fighting, soldier for teaching. At the time I was arrested and then sentenced to three years imprisonment with heart labor. <laughs> Freedom is not free. We don't sacrifice, we will never get it. Mm -hmm. You have to ask for it, you have to work for it, you have to sacrifice your life, your blood, your flesh. Mesot, som ligger nordvest i Thailand, grenser till ett av världens värsta militärdiktaturer, Burma. Denne lille byen er et viktig skjulested for burmesiske flyktninger. De lever på siden av det thailandske samfunnet, uten identitetspapirer og helt uten sikkerhet. Every day is full of risk for us. Anytime we will be arrested by the Thai police, and then maybe some active bomber say. was arrested and then sentenced to three years imprisonment with heart labor. So 1993, I was released again. Then 1994, I was arrested again and sentenced to five years again. As soon as I was arrested, so I was taken to the interrogation center. So there, so uh, for eight days. So I, it, it will take eight days at the interrogation center. Then I was sent to insane prison. Is very notorious because of because of the tortures in prison. This is our daily life in prison. Mm -hmm. So because many political prisoners are locked in the tiny cell, so that tiny cell is the apron, uh, apron of 12 feet. We must sit down like this position. Burma's generaler took makten in 1962, and have since denied the office to the leader Aung San Suu Kyi. Men det er ikke bare Suu Kyi som slåss for demokrati i Burma. Etter en studentdemonstrasjon i 1988 blev flere tusen studenter skutt. Militærjuntaen stengte universitetene og jaget studentene på flykt ut i jungelen. Mange studenter vervet seg hos etniske guerillagrupper som Karen-guerillian. De holder fremdeles kontroll over deler av området sitt ved grensen mot Thailand. That's my gun, AK-47. We are a freedom fighter, Korean freedom fighter. We use these weapons to uh, resist against the military regime in Burma. The war is going on, on, on for 52 years. One generation is gone already, so another generation is coming up to fight on. Hmm. Most of them are we are protecting our villagers and the villages near the frontline area, yeah. so that uh, people can uh, can work and can plant and can plow their field. Because mm. otherwise, the Burmese soldiers will come in and they will loot everything. They take everything. So you know we are defending and protecting our people. Karen folket are one of Burma's største folkegrupper. De har mistet store landområder, og hundretusenvis har blitt flyktninger. Mens flere guerillagrupper nå har lagt ned våpnene, nekter karenerne å inngå noen avtale med Burmas generaler. Deres frigjøringskamp er i dag verdens lengste pågående borgerkrig. Freedom is not free. We don't sacrifice, we will never get it. You have to ask for it, you have to work for it, you have to sacrifice your life, your blood, your flesh. Until people will recognize you what you're trying to do, and then they will give it to you. How are the Burmese soldiers? How are their morale? And... Their morale is very low because they don't want to fight. Yeah. Because they, they know they don't know they don't know what to fight for. Because uh, 
you know, political unrest inside Burma, like mm -hmm. on Sa Suu Kyi working for democracy movement. Yeah. And they're over here, they don't know which side, you know, to choose. One of, you know, the leaders are fighting against each other, one for dictatorship and one for democracy, so they're, they're very confusing. Burmas generaler, som styrer landet gjennom noe de kaller det statlige freds- og utviklingsråd, SPDC, har en tøff motstander i Aung San Suu Kyi. Hun vant valget i 1990 med over 80 prosent av stemmene, men har stort sett blitt holdt i husarrest siden. I 1991 fikk hun Nobels fredspris og gjorde Burmas tragedi kjent over hele verden. Hvorfor gjorde han det? Gjorde han løse sine barna? Ja. Ja? Ja. Kan du fortelle meg hvorfor du er en soldat? Fordi jeg må si meg på hvor han er kjedet. Because the Burmese killed my parents. And uh, one first thing is because the Burmese killed my parents. Second thing is we need a free current state. And because uh, we want to be free from the oppression. ตอนนี้น้องลูกมุดเดียกุยเท่าเลยแล้วพวกเราดูโพสต์ในเชลล์โดยหนูว่าคนนี้มุดเดียวดูบ้าวิ่งเตะมาเออมันหนาวนะม
Is it okay? Yeah. So? Ah, yeah, man. Nice. Dinner. There you got a picture of Aung San Suu Kyi. Yes. She worked for democracy in Burma. She is a good lady. She's a good lady. Yeah. Har du sovet da? Ja, litt. Av og til. Åh, ikke sånn, det er dritt. Så nå er det disse som er nye. Recruits? Yes, these are new recruits, and now we are ready to go out for patrol. All right. We have to. Is this their make, first day? Yes. We have to make sure they're used to the terrain and, uh, I mean, the, the situations and uh, the the weather, yeah. and also to go out and see how the forest is like in the in the in the jungle. How many soldiers do you have? Got three hundred soldiers. Three hundred. Yeah. yeah. And how many soldiers are they all together all fighting together, your cause? Uh, yeah, uh, soldiers. More than 10,000 troops. 10,000? Yeah. Soldiers? 10,000 soldiers. Mm. And how many are the Burmese? They there are, are no? 200,000. 200,000? 200,000. Okay, so how do you fight? We're using guerrilla tactics, fighting each other and uh, hit and run. Hit and run. And uh, we, we know the terrains better than them. Has there been like big, big fighting going on lately, or is in it some, sort of in calm? some some areas? Right? Some big, areas. Big fighting. Yeah. We have fighting almost every day. Yeah. Jeg er 99 prosent sikker på at det er en øvelse, men jeg vet ikke hva de gutta kan finne på. Hva skjedde? Var det en exercise? Det var en exercise. Jeg visste at noe skjedde. Jeg visste at noe skjedde. Jeg visste at noe skjedde, så at du føler seg litt ekstremt. Og det kom kjent? Ja, det kom kjent. Vi må være fast, og måten vi har praktisk, vi må være... Put them in a real situation as much as possible, so that they will prepare and they will be aware, and alert all the time. Not How far away are they? In the... We are not far away from each other. It's only about um, three kilometers. Really? Yeah. But uh, we can, and you can do the exercise we can, here. We can do the exercise it's because uh, we're. They can hear us. They can hear. They can hear. But they can't get they to can't, us. They, they normally they don't come. <laughs> normally, and, uh, if they come. <laughs> We take care of you, no problem. Yeah. Hey, 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 don't, 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 don
Okay. Otherwise, uh, more with, I, I don't want you to go back with, with one leg. Okay. Okay, yeah. okay good. Yeah. <laughs> War is not a joke, and if you don't know how to play, you lose life. It's very easy to say, but when it comes to reality, not many people can do it. Because there are some uh, good soldiers. They're saying the refugee camp because of the family. They cannot come. Oh, yeah? Some they chose, some choose to, to stay in the camps? Choose to stay in the refugee camp. Mm. But I don't blame them. It's not, it's not easy when it comes to reality. Krigen i Burma har ført til at over 300 000 karenere har flyktet hit til Thailand. Her lever de inngjæret i store flyktningeleire. All of us are soldiers. We, we are a different kind of soldier. Soldier for Korean people. A soldier for fighting, soldier for teaching. Yeah. Yeah, we are we are soldier. Some of our Korean people in Burma, I mean in Korean state, they can learn at school at all. Yeah. Because I uh, the Burmese military come to attack there. Mm -hmm. And they can't set up the school, and they cannot. I uh, they can't learn. They don't have opportunity to learn. So if yeah, they build a, build a school, then yeah, the Burmese army will come yeah, and destroy can it. Yeah, burnt. Yeah, destroy it. And put the people into <coughs> jail. Yeah, when they catch the people, they they put all the people to jail and they kill. So yeah. there is no opportunity at all to study. Yeah. For Karen people yeah. on inside Burma. Yeah, in, in I mean in. Come if you can. Mm -hmm. We have that opportunity. Mm -hmm. We have chance to study music, yeah, and, music and our Korean history. Korean history. If you want to check email or want to find out the what's happening, I mean, the, the news. Yeah, the news. But we can't get it. Get yeah. that. Yeah, we can't go down. We just stay in the camp. Yeah. Boxing er en stor ting både i Burma og Thailand. For flyktningene kan dette være den eneste jobben de kan få utenfor leieren. Norwegians, we all we travel a lot to Thailand on vacation, yeah. mm. and we look at Thai like the most gentle people in the world. But you are sometimes afraid of Thai, of Thai government. As a refugee, mm -hmm. they didn't allow us to go out, and we must we must stay in, in the camp. Must stay in the camp. If we, I mean, if we I, go. I think that if we go out, out the from the camp. If we meet a foreigner, mm -hmm. we'll tell to the foreigner that we are feeling as refugee in camp. Yeah. Now the, maybe the Thai authority, a friend of that, the foreigner will go back to their uh -huh. country and tell so the news to other people yeah. about that. What would happen with you two if you went out into Thailand today, if you went to Mesot? The police will catch and send to prison or maybe send back us to Burma. Selv ikke her, innenfor Thailands grense, kan folk føle seg trygge. Denne leieren har flere ganger blitt beskutt fra den burmesiske siden. Uh, this is the trench. Yeah. Uh, every, uh, 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 every village, mm -hmm. uh, every resident, uh, every house that is in the camp uh, has to dig a trench of their own. Okay. Uh, in case uh, the enemy 
Mm. Uh, that is, uh, that means uh, uh, DKBA and SPDC, uh, they try to uh, destroy the camps. When they, when the camps are, are, are attacked, mm. uh, mostly they are bombarded by artillery fire. Okay. Mm -hmm. Why would they attack here? Uh, the refugees. Yes, we are refugees, but the accused, the refugees are the, the refugees back the KNU. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, but are there any soldiers here? No, there any are no, guns? There are no soldiers, or there are no, no guns. Okay, but you still have to yeah, build trenches like yeah, this to stay alive. <laughs> to stay alive. Yeah, <laughs> to stay alive in the camp, in the refugee camp. Yeah. And one nation, they cannot be in a refugee camp for forever. One nation should have a place to stay. The Koreans are not a, oh, just a minority. We are just one nation, a big nation. People have to need a place to stay. And we have a written language, our state, Korean state, mm. but it's not a free Korean state. That's why we have to fight for it, ask for it, ask for freedom, mm. keep knocking, mm. keep telling the world that we're equal with the rest, and we need to have a, a freedom. Lord, my hope is in you, Lord, my strength is in you, Lord, in you. And you, I'll praise you with all of my heart. My strength is in you, Lord, in you, in you. My love is in you, Lord. My hope is in you, Lord. My strength. You think you will have a current you, state, and Lord, yeah. You, yeah. So we also this our determination. That is, uh, that is our purpose. Yes, yes. If man, a nation, the nation who doesn't have country, one day they will be lost. Dakota po, bupagli ko na dakota po. Na mo din ni, basa mula la pagni ng ibig chip the black or the black na pag bahe na pag class matay pag matig ng tal tulip matama na pater silo. Koreanerne har i dag gitt op kravet om national selvstændighed. De er Aung San Suu Kyi's allierte i kampen for et demokratisk Burma, hvor alle etniske grupper respekteres. Okay, enough. <laughs>